Hello, it's Travis, the adult male, coming to you from uh, the parking lot of Star Happy Face Man, the restaurant, also known as either Hardee's or Carl's Jr. This week, it is uh, about me eating, they just came out with a new burger. It's the Budweiser Beer Cheese Bacon burger so I figured okay brand new food item means I have to get it and I have to eat it for you guys to watch and all that so here I am I've recently though had breakfast so we'll see how I feel right now just gotta get this guy out of this bag oh look they even put like a little sticker just in case you forgot what you ordered it's right there so luckily if I forgot I would know look I got that so it's got like a beer cheese sauce on it, some Swiss cheese, some bacons, some um, lettuces, meats, other than bacon, like beefs, some caramelized onions, which is just a fancy way of saying grilled onions. So I don't know. I don't know. So we'll go ahead and um, without any much ado about nothing further, there's a look at it. Let's just go ahead and jump right in to me putting all of this in my face. There's the cheese on the wrapper. Never let the paper cheese go to waste. It's just a rule. So we'll start. <laughs> Well, it's one of the worst things ever. No, not the burger, but when you take a bite of a bacon burger, right? And the bacon doesn't cut. So when you pull your mouth away, it's like you're going to pull out the whole strip of bacon. That's just what kind of happened right there. Yeah. And it looks like there's a whole glob of onion just waiting for me. So. And so it's pretty good. Definitely pretty good right off the the bat. I'm still annoyed about that bacon. Makes me SMH fam, TCBY. But let's get into it. Let's just see if the onions are gonna become an overpowering issue. Surprisingly not. I'm usually not the biggest onion person because I don't care for anything that's healthy that's even remotely a vegetable, even if it is an onion. So, but um, when it seems like they're advertising it as being an essential part of the burger, um, it just, I feel, I don't want to not have them on there because I feel like I would be taking out an essential ingredient. That would be like if I got a teriyaki burger and said no sauce. I mean, it's ridiculous. And I hate teriyaki too. And one of these days, I'm going to do one of those. I swear it, it's going to happen. <laughs> So, what this burger does is it combines a lot of things I love, though. It combines cheese, good, meats, good, bacons, good, and then cheese sauces, which is extra good. So, ideally, 
this thing's all me. Son of a mother and father. I just noticed something's on here that I'm not very happy about. I can't tell if you'll know, be able to tell what that is as a pickle. I'm triggered. I hate pickles and I did not know they were on here. Motherfuck. Oh, there's another one right there too. Oh, bitch dick. <clears throat> and clearly this is not going to be a kid friendly episode. <laughs> oh. So next time I get this, I'm definitely going to be a no pickle situation. And I probably will get it again. Oh. That pickle just ruined my day. It really did, fam. Sad. Oh no. I can already see there's still more pickle left. I feel like pulling it out be cheating, so. I really do hate pickles. Oh my goodness, my stomach is still full from my breakfast too, so. It is almost a chore. And this thing's like just falling apart on me. Look at it, it's just like you just kind of want to get in between and be like, ah, 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 That was the drunk that still had pickle. Mm. Well, there you have it. That was. Carl's Jr.'s or Hardee's. Hold on. It was almost going to happen. <clears throat> oh, excuse me. That was Carl's Jr.'s or Hardee's beer cheese bacon cheeseburger. See, it's weird. I don't want to say it's beer cheese bacon burger, not beer bacon cheeseburger, bacon beer cheeseburger. Either way, it's that. It's pretty good. It's pretty good. Definitely gonna get it without the pickles. You should know that it has pickles on it. I did not know. Um, so that's a for sure thing. All right, go to obscuregentleman.com where you can find links to buy shirts and magnets. No, not magnets, stickers and such. Uh, you can you can find the podcast there, their web comics. Go to uh, support them on Patreon. You get these videos a day before pretty much anyone else along with other content from them do all that fun stuff all right guys and then maybe check out plane zero just saying anyways all right this is the adult male aka at plane travis aka travis coming to you live from inside the mail mobile 
saying if it doesn't get all over the place or it's something in your face. Good night or afternoon.